And welcome back. So to continue on the cerebrum, the cerebrum is composed of ridges, which is considered gyri for plural. Here will be a gyri, and the grooves between the ridges are considered soci, which will be the spaces between. The cerebrum is separated into the primary motor cortex, the central sulcus, the primary sensory cortex, and also the cerebrum, again, is the part of the brain that deals with communication. The, um, it also, there is composed of the motor homoculus, which is a figurative representation, representation of the body map encoded in the primary motor cortex. So this diagram represents that certain um, limbs are easier to move. What do you have? And then the cerebrum is composed of four major lobes. And um, the four major lobes of the cerebrum is the frontal lobe, which is the higher level processing. Then we have the parietal lobe. Then we have the occipital lobe. And then we have the temporal lobe. Again, the frontal lobe is for problem solving, judgment, and our behaviors. The parietal lobe is composed of, is responsible for our senses of touch, taste, and smell. Our occipital lobe is for vision, and the temporal lobe is the understanding of language. The cerebrum is com composed of white matter fibers that links the cerebrum together, which is Consider the corpus callosum, and the cerebellum is where the gray matter is located on the surface.